Andrew, we have the robo drill here with robotics and Renishaw inspection. This is a new solution from Fanuc? Um, not directly from Fanuc, but it's a solution we've integrated with uh, Renishaw, one of our partners. Um, we've managed to um, produce a cell here that's uh, fully automated, giving us uh, feedback of um, dimensions from the component, giving tool offsets fed back into the machine's controller. Um, benefits for the customer really are uh, uh, being able to have a closed loop system um, that they can run without human intervention. So the Renishaw Equator is communicating with the robo drill? Yeah, exactly. So um, we're monitoring um, uh, specific values on the part that's produced. That information is uh, then processed by the Renishaw Equator, keeping the dimensions within a, a nominal value. If that uh, information drifts or the, the dimensions drift, then uh, new offsets are sent back to the robo drill um, to, um, to put the uh, dimensions back into tolerance. But it's compensating, um, it's compensating for tool wear automatically, the communication between the equator and the machine, there's no human intervention? Correct, yeah. Uh, traditionally in the past, people will be measuring parts, working out uh, whether they're in tolerance and making some manual adjustments. This is now done automatically with, uh, with the information that's being processed by the equator uh, back through to the robo-drill controller. So you're, you're achieving a stable process um, and obviously better reliability and quality? Exactly, exactly. So, um, yeah, ultimately that's uh, what the customers want to produce, um, a part that's always in tolerance, no scrap, um, and they're confident that uh, they have the correct part the first time. Am I correct in thinking as well you'll also achieve um, longer run times because you haven't got to change the finishing tool so it's more productive as well? Yeah exactly, um, those offsets will help um, prolong the machining time um, for the product and um, ultimately tools will have to be changed but uh, yeah in this case um, yeah, unattended operations will, uh, will, will be improved. And this is a great example of partnerships and innovation um, and innovation um, synchronizing the in new technologies together? Um, yeah, absolutely. Um, we work with a, a number of suppliers. Renishaw, uh, we do a lot of work with. Um, they're, they're a very uh, good company to work with um, to produce and to use their technologies and uh, hopefully give customers um, a far better solution for their uh, machining processes. Thank you, Andrew. Okay, thanks a lot.